DJ Nick, DJ Nick. Yo, what is good, Lockamo Nation? Coming at y'all with another banger. We are on the road to 5K, and you see how close we are, man. Help your boy out, hit that subscribe button, turn on post bell notifications, and can we get this video to a hundred likes? Now, you see, this guy is leaving me wide open. You're probably wondering why. I mean, for one, he's a bot. I mean, look, I picked up my dribble, and he still didn't guard me until it was too late. And Watch this. Ooh, giving them ankles that he's going to jump, thinking that's going to do something, but nah. But not only is he a bot, but I'm a two-way slashing playmaker. You see me trying to just catch ankles again, getting all carried away. But I'm still greening up, you know? But I'm a two-way slashing playmaker, 69-3, not max yet, but I am very close. Now... Believe it or not, this guy's shot caller did be a slash and playmaker elite too because he was playing the same defense on him that he did me. But that guy was bricking every shot. And you see, I shot 5 for 6 from 3. 9 for 11 overall. Off of, I think I had 1 or 2 dunks. You saw how many jump shots I was green. Now, you're about to see that White's... I mean, look at this contested White. I mean, most of the time, people aren't going to play defense on you when you're a slashing type build because you have a, a low three-point rating and you don't get as many shooting badges. But you will be able to green shots with this jump shot that I'm about to give you. And just look at all the space that he's giving me. I'm a two-way slash and playmaker. He is terrified of the drive, terrified of the hop step. So he's giving me open room for jump shots. These were elites, by the way, not great ones. But you see me greening up. They were very toxic. You're going to see the box score in the end. You'll have an idea of how they played just off of the box score that you're going to see at the end. Here's proof that we won. Yeah. But my point is, you can have a low three-point rating. But with this jump shot, oh, this shot is a thing of beauty. Look at this guy getting carried by a center, but he shot 7 for 12 on a guard. How is that possible? Here's the jump shot. So the jump shot is LaMarcus Aldridge face with Dwayne Wade's release. So, since it's the same release, the blending does not matter at all. You do not have to touch it. This is the perfect slashing playmaker slasher. Basically, builds that don't get Hall of Fame shooting badges. This is perfect for that. Now, if you do get Hall of Fame shooting badges and you like Hall of Fame quick draw, you can still try this. I used to use LaMarcus Aldridge with Trey Burke's release when I play shot, but for me, it was inconsistent. But I was getting greens quite a bit, just like I said, not as consistently. But if you're a more consistent shooter than me, if you're a 60, 3.0% type guy, then go ahead, try it out. I mean, it might work for you. But I feel like this is more of a gold, silver, quick draw type shot. For me, it's perfect on gold, but it's still good on silver. So... Whatever your preference, you know. LaMarcus Aldridge, I don't like it pure. So if you're a non-Hall of Fame shooting badge build and you don't have to jump shot career, first off, I recommend you get it. And if you don't know how, there are plenty of videos on how because I don't remember exactly how to get it. It has something to do with playing my career. I know, playing my career sucks. But I do recommend playing my career for jump shot career. But if you really don't want to, it's okay. There's also pure Paul George. I was using that on this guy, and it is money. The only thing is, it's kind of slow off the dribble, and you're facing a good defender that knows how to bait jump shots, then, or bait you into taking bad jump shots, you know what I mean. Then it can be kind of tough to get that shot off, but it's still a good shot to use, and if you're playing park, most of the time you're not going to face great defenders. And if you're a two-way slash and playmaker, people aren't really going to be playing defense on you like that anyway. Now, if you're not a slasher, you know, you're a shot creator or a sharp, you need a Hall of Fame 
quick draw shot than pure Dwayne Wade. That's why I use my playmaking shot career, and I love it. That's the best shot in the game. But I don't have Hall of Fame shooting badges on this guy, and I don't know if I like Dwayne Wade with gold quick draw. And if I decide to try it, I don't want to risk getting used to the timing on gold and having to get used to it on Hall of Fame back for different players. So I, I like to use two completely different types of shots on two different players. Because I know exactly how I'm going to shoot on this guy and how I'm going to shoot on my play shot. I'm talking way too much. A lot of you probably aren't even here. If you're sticking around for this great information, then you are a high IQ player and you are better than the people that left. But that's all I got, man. Here's a video on the end screen. I recommend clicking one of those videos. I recommend subscribing, helping your boy hit 5k. I'm more than a jump shot channel. You see, I got some creative, fun, funny content that I am confident you will enjoy. And I got a comp game against an Elite 3 win, 89 win percent as my next video. And if you're watching this a couple days from now, it's on the most recent upload part of the end screen. So I recommend clicking that. Alright, I'm talking way too much. I don't know. But, yeah. I'm out. Peace.